Something takes over me. Yeah. I'm here. I'm here, family. Good morning. Oh, granitizing, shall I say. How y'all all doing today? It is a beautiful, beautiful Friday. Um, and I think tomorrow starts, uh, will be Juneteenth day. Well, Okay, where is that? Tomorrow's that Sunday, maybe? I'm going to see if I can get y'all some uh, footage. Because, like I said, uh, uh, Juneteenth is something that uh, the city of Milwaukee has always acknowledged. And, uh, in fact, one of my very first performances as a teenager was during a Juneteenth celebration. Before the rest of the world caught on, there's not too many um, cities that uh, uh, um, that acknowledged and acknowledged. Now I see that they've made it um, like what a national holiday or whatever. But I'm saying um, Juneteenth Day or Juneteenth celebration for those of y'all who celebrate the Juneteenth thing. Uh, it will be happening in a couple days. So let me just say that and get that out of the way and talk about what I really wanted to talk about. Because y'all know in this uh, program, what we talk about on this channel is mental health issues. And I think it's real, real important that y'all don't mix up who got money with uh, mental illness. So at this point, though, if you don't know, I believe that I can speak a lit, um, on this matter, and I want y'all to know how I feel about this, and I'm sure I'm not the only one. Nick Cannon is a serial, mentally ill individual, okay? He's very, he's very narcissistic. Not only is he a narcissist, this dude is really pathetic. I never thought when I used to watch him on Nickelodeon. I, all I can think of is Mariah really fucked your mind up, boy. She really did a job on you. And is, so if this is what you want to do um, to show her, because that's why I believe all of your emotional uh, heartbreak comes from. So you taking it out on all the asses that you can uh, come across, that you can lay down with. But I want y'all to understand that it doesn't matter how much money Nick Cannon has. It doesn't matter if he can take care of his children. All that's irrelevant because you can't spread yourself this thin and think that you're going to be a productive, uh, a quality father because you're not. In fact, you are, if, if it was a woman, let's, let's just keep it real. If it was a woman, that uh, was having a, a baby every year by some random guy. Um, and each year, different baby daddies, different... Y'all would call her the biggest tramp, the biggest whore, and any other name that you could probably think of. And so if y'all don't think that that applies to Nick Cannon, and I, I'm speaking to the, those of y'all who think his behavior is uh, acceptable. Nothing about Nick Cannon's behavior is acceptable. He's an embarrassment to the black community. He's an embarrassment to his family. Now, whether they come up there and admit it or not, it doesn't really matter. All I'm telling you is the boy needs help. That boy, uh, he's, he's pitiful. And he has a very, very serious mental problem. Is what is leading me to believe was, were you ever molested? What is going on with the fact that you have to impregnate all these women and you think it's normal? And then you want to lie at first and say you you a king and you want to see how many uh, 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 um, 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 children are acceptable 
because of your belief. I noticed that you done took the turban off. See, that go to show you you wasn't rooted in shit no way. Okay, you got a little piece of knowledge when you went to uh, Howard. And so you got all mixed up until them people told you to set your ass down and was finna shut it down for you. Then all of a sudden you picked up a new hustle, which is impregnating women. Uh, Y'all need to deal with this uh, Nick Cannon stuff. Nick Cannon is an embarrassment. And if you ask me, he should be ostracized for the black community. Anybody else that we knew that was performing that way, they would be kicked to the curb. They would be uh, absolutely ostracized from the community. And I don't think for one minute Nick Cannon is any different. He's an embarrassment and he needs to really, really get his head checked. I'm embarrassed for him and I'm going to step out there and say it. I don't got no dog in this fight other than your mama is 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 got to be around my age or a little younger. And if your, your mother and father haven't taught you anything or is it because you got money, you feel like this is okay if you can do that. But if nobody is giving you any words of wisdom, you need to go and get you a good therapist, dude, and find out what's the reason behind all this impregnation of these and making all these children that you cannot, it's impossible for you to give them the love and the commitment that they need. And you can't split yourself down the ways that way. So as far as I'm concerned, you need to be canceled. If they say, if it's a cancel culture, your ass should be canceled. Cancel Nick Cannon. Cancel him. Because he's got some serious, serious mental, mental problems. All right. Now, I know a lot of y'all won't get mad about it. But I'd like to know what you think about it. Leave your comment below. I'll see you in the next video.